know, it's almost 12 months a week that, uh, that I've got the amazing opportunity to play against South Africa at the Principality Stadium last year and, um, and it's been a, a great 12 months really. Well done. We really enjoyed what you're doing over there and, and we wish you all the best. Go hit me, go! Go hit me, go! Go hit me, go! Go hit me, go! Louis, stop picking your nose! <laughs> oh, that's awesome, Mark. Um, yeah. No. Ooh. <laughs> Bit emotional. Um, yeah. Look, it's, yeah. I'm very thankful for that, so. It does feel like time's just flying by, but it's um, yeah, you're never tired of watching that. You know, it's um, it's pretty cool seeing all the nieces and nephews as well. Um, yeah, that little comment there from my uh, sister-in-law Louis it will always be remembered for that. So it's um, yeah, it's been amazing. So I've loved every moment of it. So you know, it's been awesome to be involved in three of the fixtures in this autumn, and it was the Six Nations from there. Then went on a um, summer tour, and that was amazing to get away off the boys and the management on that, and then to be involved again this year in this. So it's it's good to get plenty of game time. There's a huge amount of competition within the squad, um, and I think it's really good. It's um, pushing boys at training, and it's also the boys are playing really well. You can just see by the, the scoreline in the Tongan game that you know there's a huge amount of competition for positions. I think on Saturday it's going to be one of those games that if we can meet, match them physically um, and we can control what we want to do, they've um, probably gone back to a little bit of the old South African ways of just being extremely confrontational and physical and they've got some extremely big boys there and that's what they've been doing, they've literally been trying to get over the advantage line and then trying to make the opposition make mistakes so hopefully we'll have a, a nice evening of, um, of rugby.